Hi, I'm Arthur Elliott. Welcome to my show. I'm a chef, an educator, and a perfectionist. And I'm here to teach the world the cooking basics. Welcome to Cooking Basics. Today is a big one, boiled water, one of my absolute favorites, and I can't wait to show you how it's done. So let's get right to it. Locate a one quart saucepan. We're using a one quart saucepan because we're boiling one cup of water. I know there are bigger pots out there, but that's harder math. Here's a special tip. If you need more than one cup of boiled water, just repeat this recipe as many times as you need. For those of you new to the kitchen, a sink in a kitchen is much like a sink in a bathroom or a sink in a morgue except it's in a kitchen. Now get your measuring cup out and find the cold water setting on your sink and fill your cup up to the one cup mark. Transfer your water from your measuring cup to your pot. If you're like my cousin Ross, you'll want to add a pinch of salt here, but don't do that because that's a different recipe. Place your saucepan on the stove. Your stove may look like this one, or maybe not, that's okay any stove will do. Beware going forward. A hot stove is the third most dangerous thing in your kitchen, next to dulled knives and the complexities of the human ego. Find the stove's knob that corresponds to the burner you've placed your pot on. First try. And now we wait for the water to boil. You may want to put the lid on the pot to keep the heat in, but the pros consider that cheating. Now we've all heard the rumor that a watch pot never boils, but this is untrue, and I will prove it to you now. See, it's just a myth. Don't believe what everyone tells you. And now we have boiled water. Way to go, guys. Now with your boiled water, there are so many applications, or you can just drink it. Thanks for joining us. Keep practicing, and remember, never take for granted the cooking basics. All these recipes come from food.com, where users are encouraged to leave comments. Let's see if we can find a few good ones. That's no good. That's no good. Oh, the watch pot never boils. We disproved that theory. I love your recipe. Such a wonderful pick-me-up on a cloudy, chilly day. There's nothing like warm drinks on a cold day. And it's gluten-free, too. That's Mrs. Cupcake. That's a great tip for you health nuts out there. 